Welcome everyone. In this video, I'm going to go through a moles calculation. First, we will work out the amount of a reactant. We will then use this amount to work out the maximum mass of a product that can be formed. This question is from a BTEC Level 3 Applied Science paper. Details are in the description. The content is also relevant to A-level chemistry students. Let's get started. Here's the question. The equation for the reaction of dilute hydrochloric acid with calcium is shown. Calculate the maximum mass of calcium chloride produced by reacting 8.02 grams of calcium with excess hydrochloric acid. And we're given the relative atomic mass of calcium and the relative atomic mass of calcium chloride. Show your working out. We are given some data associated with the calcium. The mass of calcium is 8.02 grams. The molar mass of calcium is 40.1. You will need to be familiar with the equation amount is equal to mass divided by molar mass. The symbols for these variables are given here in red with units. The amount of calcium works out to be 0 0.200 moles. The balanced chemical equation gives us the ratio in which substances react to form products. The formal term for this concept is stoichiometry. There are no balancing numbers in front of the calcium or calcium chloride. One mole of calcium will produce one mole of calcium chloride. Two moles of calcium will produce two moles of calcium chloride, and so on. The maximum amount of calcium chloride that can be produced is equal to the amount of calcium that reacts. This is called a one-to-one -one reaction. The maximum amount of calcium chloride that can be produced is 0 0.200 moles. To work out the mass of calcium chloride, we use mass is equal to amount multiplied by molar mass. The maximum mass of calcium chloride that can be produced is 22.2 grams. Thanks for watching. I hope you found the video useful. Please post in the comments if you've got any questions or suggestions. Take care and good luck with your studies.